Pediatricians are tonight sounding the alarm about a concerning side effect of coronavirus that they're seeing. As Caroline Vandergriff reports now, Texas ranks only behind Washington, D.C. for the worst child immunization rate right now in the country. Under the threat of COVID-19, many families are avoiding a trip to the doctor's office for pediatric checkups. There is a lot of people that actually are scared to come out. Which means a lot of kids are falling behind on their immunizations. So we pulled some reports and were able to determine that our patients, much like many patients across the country as well as the globe, had missed on some important vaccines. From March through May, 66,000 children got their vaccines at a Cook Children's facility, compared to more than 80,000 during the same time period last year. That's a 20% drop. So we've been focusing really diligently over the past two months now to get those patients in, to educate our families about the importance of vaccines. Because even though coronavirus is top of mind right now, it doesn't mean all other diseases have disappeared. These are deadly illnesses, pertussis, meningitis, measles. We don't want to forget that those are still out there. Pediatricians are worried families will continue to delay getting shots if kids don't physically return to the classroom. Some parents think children don't need their vaccines if they're not going out. But I bet we go somewhere. We might go to the grocery store. We might go to um, a shopping mall. We might go to work because it's part of our career and we're considered essential. And so we ourselves can be a risk to our children. They recommend sticking to your child's vaccination schedule, regardless of what happens with schools. So a, a way that we protect our kids is through immunizations. Caroline Vandergriff, CBS 11 News.